we've toured our asses off for, for years, and this year is like we're touring harder and longer than we ever have. A lot of people think touring is like a big vacation, and I'm just like, you have no idea. Like, it's very grueling, it's very difficult, it's hard for your mind. It's being in a different city every single night for months on end is insane. Like, humans are not supposed to do that. You kind of just forget where you are sometimes. When you're on the road forever, you, you like never want to play music again almost. You're just like, you're just like, I'm done, I need a whole year off. And then you get a couple months off and you're like itching to get back out because it, you know, that's what we do. It's not a, like, it's not even a thought to stop doing this, you know, um, not anymore. It's not the struggle that it once was where we just didn't know how we were going to get by. Now, you know, we're, we're getting by and now it's just about making good art, you know, and, uh, and feeding people. always ask us you know how, how how are things changing and I think we're just trying to we're trying our best to make it not change things for us and keep things as real as they always have been I mean the whole thing is like I don't want to think that things have changed I try to take everything in stride so it doesn't get too surreal but there are moments like you know I passed out in the airport on the way to Primavera from exhaustion and had to be revived by medics and then made the plane and played the show and i thought i was gonna die like i thought we killed it but <laughs> i just went for it as hard as i could because i said well this is the last one let's go and uh and so it was a really good show <laughs> i will still ball one every seven shows or so um and i'll just break down on the stage and it's not it's not fake you know it's really from those initial moments of of living those things and then feeling them again through the music. Been a long time in a low place. I feel like as a performer is one of the strongest things like I have in my life. And um, I feel it's like my job to to be honest and to to break myself for the people that need that in their life. creating an environment for people to feel emotion in a public setting, to give them the power to feel free enough to, to be free. I think touring, like, a huge amount of time will pass, and if you're not careful it'll just totally blow by you know everything that i do i do to get closer to my family but all of it takes me just farther away from them actually physically farther away from them there's friends and family back home it's always been tough but th this year just because we've been gone so much you know it's been really hard and that's like the thing that i'm trying to remember in life is that you don't have to push so hard all the time um, you need to enjoy yourself and enjoy moments and enjoy friends. What I need to do is just take a deep breath and sit on the couch with my mom and dad and watch TV and just be there for them to look at and I'll look at them and then we'll all be happy. Those things can go away. They do sometimes, it's kind of sad. The one thing that definitely keeps me going is the show itself. If you're tired, depressed, or whatever, you just play the show and it's like everyone's pretty much immediately just like stoked. One, two, three. Winners! All right. See you guys. So yeah, they're yeah. going to it, right? Yeah.
the men of the body. Future Islands is what I want it to be. And there's a fear in it growing too big. You know, I'm prepared to be playing on those big stages. That doesn't scare me at all. And I accept it. But I also don't want to lose touch with who I am as a person, who Garen William are as people, and who our fans are as people. The whole music world is, is kind of a small world. We've sort of cultivated or built this second family out here on the road. Like, you know, we have friends now that we've known for you know, over a decade just through playing music. And that's really beautiful. And I wanted you to know I was thinking about you. Maybe you look like I think we all feel the same, that we've been pretty successful for a while. We love to do this. This is something we, I think we're all really talented at, and uh, it's a lot of fun. Why not? Why not go for it? Away from hope.